Can I just say, all in all, it's been a great life together. We've enjoyed 50 years of knowing each other. We dated for 50 years and been married for 48. And we're happy to celebrate. Oh, man. The first time I saw him was at uh, his apartment with a bunch of guys. I was sitting at 204 in the apartment, Dave Gunn's apartment, that he shared with the, you know Gary Miller and Art Byron, that bunch, and uh, Dick Cockrell. I walked in with my brother, Roger, and he introduced us. And uh, Roger Rohrbach walked in. I think it was the late fall, early winter of 66, 67. And right behind walks this uh, young lady who he introduces to us as a sister and she just moves right on through and goes to the back room to see somebody else. And we both said, hi, nice to meet you. I remember she had a very bright smile because she had braces at the time. She had a very bright smile. She was wearing some kind of very fluffy animal fur thing. I had on this big old furry coat, fake fur. It was during the, it must have been in the fall, but it must have been chilly. But no, you know, lightning didn't strike in particular, other than it was Roger's sister. And, uh, you know, it was okay, but no, no big, no, no thunderbolts from the sky. But there were no vibrations whatsoever. <laughs> We became really good friends first. And we had been out to maybe the Viking pub, and she had to, she had to leave early, had to get her to the, this babysitting job. And as I dropped her off and was thinking that spring break was coming, as she walked away and walked toward the house, I thought, man, I'm not real sure. I want this to be, you know, the separation thing is not good. I don't like it. And we thought, we don't want to not see each other every day like we have been doing. I think I have awful strong feelings for her. I think that's that that was the time I really started thinking that uh, this my I was in uh, I was in trouble. <laughs> so actually, it grossed me out because I did not want to fall in love with somebody else. Couldn't have said it better myself. Oh. <laughs> You don't want to know. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty weak. <laughs> oh, uh, you don't want to know. Yeah. You don't want to go there. We never really had a honeymoon. Another one of my great moments. Uh, I had asked your brother Bill for advice on to where, after the wedding, you know, the first night, because we were leaving, we weren't going to spend a long honeymoon at all. And he suggested the Tall Corn Motel in, was that in Davenport, Iowa, yep, across the across river? Across the Mississippi. <laughs> but anyway, that's what Bill suggested. So Orange I, I, tag carpet. I called the place up and made arrangements for two nights. And it was pit the pool was drained. It was nothing it was on a vinyl floor. Nothing to do, really. You know, yeah. After a while. <laughs> at all, honestly. <laughs> we invited Bill and Peg over to play cards the second day. <laughs> Yeah. It was a. Uh, and then moved to New Jersey. Yeah, yeah. That was a. So the Tall Corn Motel was like, you know, bad chain link fence. Bad. <laughs> Not much. <laughs> wow. I love that he doesn't stay upset. Wow. Pretty hard to get down to one. Her smile. And she likes to laugh. And she sings. He's really a lot nicer than I am, but he's also a lot naughtier than I am. But I think we fit perfectly. And I love that he is faithful and true and trustworthy. <laughs> One thing, yeah. The laugh, the smile, her faith, oh my gosh. And he's crazy about me, he tells me. <laughs> She's a great mother. One thing, uh, one of those. Top 20. One of the big members certainly has to be our first place together, our apartment in, in New Jersey. Because we were alone and on our own. Yeah, alone and on our own. And 
23 and 21. On the East Coast? <laughs> wow. Which was kind of nice our first year. Yeah. yeah. That was great. It was great. And then the trip that year to uh, to Washington, D.C. to visit David Bargone. <clears throat> we, already had, we had the winter break for, we had two weeks, I think. We were going down there for a couple of days and we spent almost the full two, two weeks. weeks there. Two, through, instead of two days, we stayed Through, through Christmas and then into <laughs> New Year's. Sang in the church choir there. Went, <laughs> this, it was great. F vacation at Houghton Lake together as a family. Our summer vacations, trips out west together as a family. Watching, taking you guys to school for me, taking them to school after, you know, as they started growing up and we would travel to school together, I'd be with you guys all day at school, playing ball in the summer. Those are, those are some great times. Love you. We would do it again yeah. and we're very grateful. Pine, went to the Viking Pub. Those places were nice on Fridays and Saturdays, you know, dancing and some libations. Our first date was the Taming of the Shrew, wasn't it?